Today is the extraordinary beginning of a new era. My name is Jared, and tomorrow is my birthday. I should also apologize very much so for the fact that the last Mope video apparently had some issues with uh, synchronization. Very interestingly, the version of my computer had perfect matching with the um, with the, what's the word for it again? Oh yes, with the, the screen and with the audio, but interestingly during the upload it got scrambled and my various attempts to fix it have all been futile. However, I did decide to keep it up because there are actually some people that like philosophical musings. And so, uh, it is also with great pleasure that I announce that I have also completed two-thirds of the, uh, 30-day speaking challenge for the fantastic Lao language, and in honor of that, I'm going to name my character after someone in the dialogue, so I remember his name was Boon Mi. Okay, I don't really remember exactly how it's spelled in transliteration, but I'm just simply going to hope that that's good enough. Actually, why don't I use my smartphone and actually to find out what it is? Okay, so is it spelled like that? Okay, and apparently if you write that, Okay, Boonmi, yeah, uh, I get one crab on, very good. Okay, so, Boonmi, I choose you. And, uh, let's see, this time I'm going to shut off the ad, um, or is this the ad itself? The, no, this is actually a modernist. No, you keep. You have extremely poor taste in music, and you have extremely poor taste in buffering as well. Okay. You deserve good music in your life, Mr. Ad. We need to talk. Okay, so, very well. So this time, I'm going to be a mouse, and hence Bunmi the mouse adventures into the fantastic world of predation, but also opportunities, as long as... No, 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 get in there, get in there. Okay, I'm staying in here, and I'm not getting out. I can stay here all day if necessary. Hello. I have made my home here, and you're, I'm afraid, going to have to live with the fact that I'm not going to get out of here until you're out of sight. Okay. Safe to leave. Lump dum Here's an idea. Why doesn't somebody actually make Mope.io the musical? That would actually be quite interesting, but uh, my understanding is that a lot of musical theater projects on YouTube do tend to be of uh, significantly poor quality. Actually sound like they were written by elevators. I have no idea what I just said. And so, oh, okay, oh, in here. So, imagine you are living in this giant hole right now. You have a refrigerator, you have a computer, you have a bunch of educational books, and you also have a very supportive community. Okay, here I am in the Arctic. It, I do not remember Greenland looking like this, and interestingly I have now turned into a rabbit. A rabbit who will probably be winning awards in the Winter Olympics whenever they are next, or not. Uh, this feels like a Zena game of bumper cars to me. Boon me cars. Okay. By the power invested in me by all the loud dialogues I have learned thus far that are completely irrelevant to this game about animals eating things with green circles. Uh, okay. So, here I am, investigating the many, many sides of the world. I'm, I'm curious, uh, designers of this game, is there a possibility that you can somehow implement a snowball fight? This actually might be a very interesting idea. I understand the vast majority of species present in this game actually lack any variety of opposable thumbs. However, sometimes I think that you need to actually sacrifice reality for fun. And you tasted delicious, I will have you know. But, hello, Mr. Little Guy. Wanna be, wanna meet my friend? Friend is called my mouth. <laughs> Very well. And now I'm a penguin. I'm a penguin. Dee 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 dee. I am a penguin. Dee 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 dee. I am a penguin. Yeah. Dee 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 dee. Okay. I think that I could probably work on my songwriting skills and develop them further. But I am very much inspired by the the Arctic. As I was in real life, um, I can actually tell you a little bit about Nuke, now that I think of it. So, for those of you who are unaware, I was actually in Greenland. Okay, so much. You are interrupting my travel log. No, 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 get in here. No, that's not what I have. 
Okay, so while I wait for Meow the Seal, who probably has a very significantly confused sense of identity, you get in here. Okay, here I am. So Greenland was a fantastically soulful space uh, face. I remember, interestingly, there on the plane ride there, I actually had two significant fortunes. One was the fact that, um, well, actually one fortune and one misfortune. Uh, the misfortune was the fact that I was actually seated right next to the propeller jet plane engine and actually felt during the majority of the flight, I'm a seal. Um, Speaking of Greenland, okay, felt during the majority of the flight that I actually had, on the way there, thankfully not on the way back, that there was a giant buzzsaw in my ear. I'd rather have a giant buzzsaw than have a walrus chasing me. You two can be friends. I'm just simply going to stay here, and I'm not going to get out. And I didn't actually know you could name characters emojis. If you about... Apparently saw that little mole that was just passed by a few seconds ago. Apparently he was named, um, how do I put it? Um, my knowledge of the emoji alphabet is significantly limited. Um, but no, 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 okay. Safety. Okay, but first food. Okay, home. No. Okay. So, uh, I forgot exactly what story was telling. So the good fortune was, I remember, was actually at 6 p.m. local time in which my plane was descending into the airport at Nuke. And um, my first reaction was, given that it was like the very end of twilight and the um, sun wasn't anywhere in sight. Uh, um, uh, where was I? The, the sun wasn't anywhere in sight. I actually felt that I was on the moon. I didn't even really feel that I was on the same planet. I actually flew in from uh, Reykjavik. Uh, I proceeded to attend the Polyglot Conference, which is, an, how do I put it? It was a, it's a yearly event where people uh, who love languages from around the world, they come together and then they attend talks about language learning. They speak with many people in many of the world's tongues. And uh, as I think one person, one of my Facebook friends, although I cannot remember who exactly said this, it's uh, like you can't spend five minutes, five seconds even, without running into an extremely interesting person at the Polyglot Conference. It's uh, very interestingly unlike this game, which you can't spend like five seconds without running into a threat. <sighs> okay. I know how you feel, Mr. Rabbit, but unfortunately, I'm slightly more inclined to be selfish. Okay. Okay, where was I? Okay. Um, I pr actually presented at the Polyglot Conference over the course of the past year in a presentation that I don't exactly know when it's getting released online. It's on using how, it's on learning, using video games to learn languages. Get out of my way. <sighs> Imagine if they actually tried to regulate this world, you know, with traffic lights and laws. My understanding is that because this is actually a computer simulation of some variety that there actually is some variety of laws, but imagine if you actually got penalized for a um, variety of actions similar that you could uh, incur fines for traffic violations. But uh, I'm certain that the SEAL is very very glad that it is not an automotive vehicle. Come to think of it, I'm glad that I'm not an automotive vehicle either. Aren't you? No, 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 no. So in the Arctic, it's actually significantly different than in the greener climes to the south because I think the primary challenge that one runs into is the fact that the water scarcity is probably the uh, primary thing that is, proves to be difficult. I am a reindeer. Dee 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 dee. I am a reindeer, and I can't go very far in here. Okay. Okay, but uh, I think very much has been pro has been proven by the history of war. I think that people actually hone their singing abilities, as sad as it may seem, during times of trouble. And I think that certainly, surrounded by a bunch of these predators, I will certainly have my uh, my opportunities to write songs significantly enhanced by being chased by giant saber-toothed tigers. But there's also another way to enhance one's songwriting abilities, and I'm afraid this is called degree acquisition. I have enough of those already, but for other topics, uh, like on learning the history of my people, okay, and of human beings in general, okay. 
here I am. There's probably a giant disco club in the basement of that hole. Okay, now I'm an arctic fox. No, 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 And hereby concludes the tale of Bun Mi. He lived with great enthusiasm and a desire to improve his abilities to sing. But apparently, in one of his last songs, he was eaten by a giant snow leopard. And then, from then on, his name will be remembered. His songs will not be forgotten. But alas, Bun Mi is no more. I'm gonna have to think about that for a while. Why did you have to do that? But, uh... Until then, this is Jared letting you know that you can be something! Have a good one, and see you next time. Oh, and tomorrow's my birthday. Happy birthday, me, on the early side. Bye.